This is White Boy Bryce, third episode of Kills and Grills It, and today's video is on how to film your own hunt. And by the way, this is my first hunt, so I'm also filming my own first hunt for the first time. And everyone always tells me how that they wish they would have got their first hunt on video because they got buck fever, or they just want to see their emotions over and over again. By the way, check out this shirt. Heritage, unity, nature, tradition. I'm very excited to be a part of the hunting tradition. Now we're gonna go in depth of what I'm gonna be using during the hunt. Right here, I got the VO2 monopod for your gun. And for the camera, I got the VO2 TV. And that's for your camera. And I really like both of these because I can use my foot and one hand to control them. My bolt of choice is Luminot bolts. And they light up on the end. And one, because it's gonna look sweet when you smoke the deer. And it's going to look sweet on video. One thing I want to talk about is my Tachycam. And I have it mounted on the bottom of a Picatinny reel on my crossbow. And I need to make sure that the Tachycam can see through the window of the ground blind. That way I'm not filming the ground blind. You can actually see the deer through the Tachycam. Alright, now my crossbow choice is I picked the Burnett Recruit Compound Bow. And I really like this crossbow. It has three dots on the scope. I have... 20, 40, and 60, because I'm not planning on shooting any farther than that. Practice makes perfect, and this will be a dead gear. And look how well this Luminox bolt shines. This is a target, and it's the size of a fawn, like a fawn, like a really small deer. And I'm shooting a, about an inch low, and with a mature deer with a bigger kill zone, I'll probably be able to hit that, but I'm gonna keep practicing. This white boy Bryce, and make sure to like this video on our Facebook channel, Kills It and Grills It, and as always, be safe and shoot straight. This is Brooke the cook on Kills It and Grills It.